All right, keep it going for your next comic coming to the stage, Mitch Nelson. So, uh, yeah, you guys, uh, I, I ran across this weird thing um, a while ago down in uh, Wyoming. I fell and uh, I stumbled. Actually, I, I, I got really tired. And one of the cool things, though, one of the cool things, though, is if you were there, you would laugh. Because uh, I look really amazing when I fall, like hilarious. And you're never going to see it because it's it, completely immoral for you to trip me. <laughs> it, and, 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 and the other thing is, I'm never going to have battle scars from fights and falling down that way either because no one's ever going to fight me. Like, I'll go down a dark alley, and honestly, I swear, I have more people saying, Hey, dude, if you ever need any help, we'll, we'll kill anyone for you. <laughs> and I'm just like, what the? No, 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 no. Okay. So, so yeah, I, I, I'm loving this new thing. I found out the word for it is called ableism. It's awesome. I love it. It's, I'm like, it's, like, it's like better than white privilege. <laughs> Which I also have a little bit of. But I'm still jealous. I'm still jealous because I swear at McDonald's, I've been eating breakfast at McDonald's because it's a mile away and I can fight that. And I need to fight because this is not a attractive body figure anymore. As if it ever was silly me. But uh, what, I found, what I found was this other privilege, better than white privilege, better than ableism privilege or whatever i'm gonna have to come up with a name for that but it's old lady privilege imagine this like this lady this old lady i saw her walk up to a strange child and give the child a hug and i'm thinking wow what if i tried that <laughs> see See, that's why it's funny, because it's true. Man, she could totally do that. And then my friend, another old lady that I had been talking to while she read the paper and we ate breakfast, she goes, I go, what are you going to do the rest of the day? And she goes, oh, there's a new park opening that has, uh, like, a, it's that new spring park up on the west side. And uh, she's like, I think I'm going to go sit, a sit and read a book and watch the kids. And again, I was like, there's no way I'm ever going to get to do that. I don't get to just sit at a park and read a book and watch kids. It, I'm, too, I'm, I'm right there. I know there's other people out there, though, that are much worse off that would not even get close to the park before some parent came and shot them. <laughs> so, but anyway, uh, I, think that's, uh, I think that's about all I got to cover tonight. I'm going to talk to you later.